Statues in London you may not know the history behind. First, we're at Piccadilly Circus at the statue a lot of people think is Cupid or Eros, the god of love, but it's actually his brother, Antaros, the god of requited love. Next, we're in Camden where we have the statue of Amy Winehouse. This one is special as it was installed only three years after her death, which is not common for memorial statues. Take a walk through Cannizzaro Park in Wimbledon and you'll see the statue of Diana and the Fawn. She's considered to be the goddess of both wild and domestic animals and also the protector of women during childbirth. Along Chelsea Embankment, you'll find the George Sparks Memorial Fountain, an amazing example of a Victorian civic fountain. Speaking of fountains, head to Bank and you'll see the Cornhill Fountain, open to commemorate the jubilee of the Metropolitan Drinking Fountain and Cattle Trough Association. Next, we're headed by the Walkie Talkie Building to see what is possibly London's smallest statue, the Philpot Lane Mice. No one knows exactly why they're there, but very curious nonetheless.